Hi, my name is, uh, is Jennifer DiBernardi. My mom is Lorraine Roach, and um, she's been missing since um, May 10th or 11th of 2013. Um, she was reported missing on May, um, on May, uh, May 13th. Um, the reason why I know she was, went missing was I tried to contact her on Mother's Day. Um, nobody has seen her since. She's been missing from the Peterborough, um, Ontario area. Her vehicle was found at the side of the road um, in an area that was, um, which she would have commonly used to go back and forth um, into the city um, from her home. We miss her immensely. We don't know why she went missing. Um, she suffered from depression most of her life. Um, which she was medicated for, but at times I think that, you know, she felt that she didn't need um, certain medications. Um, she had lots of things happen to her that nobody should have had happen. And I'm not quite sure if that's why she left or something happened to her. So we are just asking that anybody that knows any information about her disappearance, um, whether it's small or it is a big piece to contact um, the crime, crime Stoppers or to contact the Ontario OPP. We've done ground searches, we've done flyering, we've done a Facebook page, we've tried a lot of things that, that, we can, that we can think of, but we need the public's help, we need anybody's help just to, just to find her and to um, give us something that we can hope for or closure um, we, we just love her and, um, we hope that she's alive. Um, but it's hard every day because it's been so long now. Um, and going, coming up to her birthday in November, she would be 60 and to not know if she's alive, um, is really hard. Her family's been trying to um, stand together, but we don't know if somebody harmed her. And if they did, just, you know, just just come forward. Or if somebody knows that somebody did something, we just ask that they that they that they that they step forward and do the honorable thing and to let us have some closure. Again, you can find information about my mom on our missing Facebook page, um, Missing Lorraine Roach. And you can send us personal messages there. We will contact the police if you don't feel comfortable. Um, any, and again, anything will, is helpful to us at this point. We just, need to, we just need to know what's happened to her. And mom, if you are there and you somehow see this, just contact us. We don't have to... We don't have to know where you are. We just want to know that you're alive and that you're safe. And um, if you're doing things that you just need to do, you need to work through something, then, um, you know, we can help you too if you're not getting help that you need. Um, but we just need to know. Oh, I know what Emma's mom is feeling. Um, to go searching for your daughter um, and not knowing what you're going to find. Um, or just in the hopes of you find something. My family and I did that even after um, the, the police had continued their investigation. Nobody should have to look in creeks and waters to find a, a body of somebody that they love because, um, because they feel like we have to, because we have to somehow um, feel like we're engaging in this investigation and we want to um, feel like we're doing everything we can, but it's the most horrible feeling to, to do that. And I don't wish that on anyone. Um, I have hope that my mom is alive. Um, I think we all kind of have to have a little bit of that um, to make it through every day. Um, but the reality is, is that, you know, the longer the, the person is missing, um, you know, the reality is it's, you know, probably that she won't be um, found alive. Um, but we can hope for those miracles. And um, sometimes they happen. You, you do hear about them. They are a little bit far and few between. Um, but it does give you give you something. Um, to uh, hope for it kind of gives you that um a little bit of you know get up and go every day just to think that you know today may be the day that you know something happens and we find my mom um and uh yeah so I do have hope that she, that she's uh, found alive and um 
Um, if we if we don't find her alive, at least we can have closure and um, we can um, do what we need to do as a family to um, to heal. You can't heal when you don't have an answer.